Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I just wanted to give you all a little bit of an update and share something really exciting that happened last night. In some of my previous videos this year, I've talked about trying to get a reallocation for bus service through VTA. So basically that would mean shifting money from highways to bus service to build a more sustainable transit system here. So a number of us have been to a few board meetings and we've asked for this and we've asked them to set up a workshop to talk about this or talk about it at a future board meeting. And we finally made some progress last night. Supervisor Chavez made a referral to have the board discuss these sorts of things at a future meeting. Her referral was kind of vague, but she did specifically mention Measure B in it. So I'm not gonna go into all the details about all this because most of you probably don't care. But I think that the message that I really wanna share here is that your voice absolutely does matter and you can have an impact on things. It's been about a year since I started regularly going to these board meetings. I've been taking transit from various transit agencies for as long as I can remember, but I didn't actually know that I could change things and make things better for a really long time. Buses would get cut and it would be really sad, but I wouldn't really do anything about it. The first transit related meeting that I went to was I think when I was about 19 and it was just a VTA outreach meeting. I said things at that meeting but I never went to a board meeting and followed up. So it's really only been a year since I've really been taking this seriously and I've really been and it's honestly been really really hard to stay positive. I don't even know how many meetings I've gone to but it's probably about 50 or 40. Most of the time I'm taking hours out of my day and sometimes even losing pay to go to these things and my comments and other comments from members of the public usually go completely unrecognized, which is really hard. And there've been so many times when I just wanted to give up because I just have felt like there's nothing that I can possibly do to change things. But last night really showed me that there are things that I can do to change things. And even if you're not getting the big thing that you wanted, you can do small things change just from you making your voice heard. Even just in my community, even just in Cambrian, people are already talking about transit issues just because of me. And there's so many people that I've been able to educate and other trans advocates have been able to educate just by making our voices heard and saying things. The little things really matter. Politics is slow. So really hold on to these little victories, even if it's just someone acknowledging something that you said or someone saying something in a very vague way, that's still progress and that still means that you're having some sort of an impact. I'm still frustrated with politics. I still wish that things would move a lot faster. I've said that every voice matters and every voice counts in a lot of my videos, but to be honest, I haven't always believed it this year, but now I really believe it again. I saw that what I said had an impact last night. I think that's pretty much everything that I wanted to say. Just wanted to come on here and make a short little video to share the exciting news and remind you all that you can have an impact on things just by speaking up. So I hope you all have a very good rest of your day and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video. Goodbye.